Hello, your tech admin here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to change your GDM theme in Ubuntu 11.04. Now, by when I say change your GDM theme, I don't mean just change the wallpaper or anything like that. I mean actually change the whole theme. Um, so yeah, the first thing you have to do is select a theme that you want and some icons and a wallpaper to go with it. I have a uh, London Smoke GTK theme, a Top Talk icon theme, and a wallpaper that I picked at pure random for this tutorial. Okay, so there are actually two ways to do this. Um, there's the command line way and the um, GUI way. I'm going to go with the GUI this time because, you know, people are kind of afraid of the command line. But I will be pasting the um, command lines, um, the commands for the command line to, to do this a lot quicker. So uh, the first thing you're going to do if you're doing this by the GUI is open terminal. Type sudo nautilus. Hit enter, type your password. Alright, so here is a root um, Nautilus window. You can go ahead and minimize this terminal. Alright, so from here we're going to go to File System, uh, var, lib, gdm, and then we're going to hold down Control and press H to show you the hidden files and folders. So here we see a dot icon and a dot theme folder. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open a new tab in this Nautilus. You do that by holding down Control and pressing T. And I'm going to browse to where I have my theme files stored at right now, which is on my current user's desktop. So there they are. So I'm going to copy the icons first. Copy those right in there. Next to theme. There we go. And I'm going to create a folder and name it pictures and copy the wallpaper into that. So there we go. Now we're done copying the theme files over. Next thing to do is enable the um, appearance window to open up. Um, at the startup of GDM. So the easiest way to do this is just go to System Preferences, right click on the Appearance Launcher and add this panel to the desktop. I mean, not to the panel, but to the desktop. I did that wrong, sorry. Uh, there it is, okay. Press the wrong button. Anyway, once you get that there, you're gonna, in your Nautilus window, you're gonna go to User, Share, GDM, auto start login window and you're just going to drag this in now that you've done that you're ready to log out and set your theme so I'm going to log out real quick and I'll see you in a second alright we're now on my login screen as you, see, uh, as you can see the appearance preferences window has come up um, at startup or when we enter the login screen so now um, your theme should be sitting in here and if it isn't um, you're going to go to uh, install and you're just going to go to where you put the files at um, dot icons for the icon files dot themes for the theme files and then you're going to go customize and you're going to find all the stuff that you installed and I installed London Smoke remember um, London Smoke and my top talk icons so there you go um, and the background um, if it's not already there you can just go to add and here's the picture I had picked so there you go as you can see it works change this to whatever I want um, any theme I want it's very simple I'm gonna go ahead and set back what I like to have it on alright once you're done, you can just go ahead and um, close that and log back into your desktop. And I'll see you there in a second. Alright, so now that we got our theme set, we want to disable the application, I mean the um, appearance preferences window from starting up with GDM. So there's a simple command for that, and I'll post it below the video. Uh, but I'm going to show you how to do it through the GUI. Again, sudo, or sudo nautilus. Right. We're just 
going to go to user share GDM auto start login window and just remove the preferences shortcut that we put here I have to remove desktop recorder because I put it in there so I could obviously record the login screen earlier so uh, yeah once you get done with that you can just close that and you are done uh, I hope this guide helped you if you have any questions uh, feel free to leave a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can anyways uh, thanks for watching and until next time guys